channel. Today we are doing a Shein haul. Woof, woof. And we got to go shopping. And we had yes. an excuse for it. This, we, so, this is an excuse to buy a whole lot of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> excuse Lainey's barking. <laughs> so we shopped till we dropped and now we're gonna show you all of our items and tell you the goods and the bads. Let's yes. Go. So I'm gonna start off with just some of the bathing suits that I've gotten from Shein. All of these are from this year, except for this one piece that I actually got last year. This is my very first Shein purchase ever. I did ever. not I know that was from, that Shein. Was from Shein like, for yeah, the longest time. I got it last year, I love that kind of randomly. Yeah. Um, and it is from Shein, it's the first thing I've ever gotten from them. It's just this one piece with this little hole in the center. It's really, really cute. It reminds me of a picnic table. <laughs> I think I got this in a medium. If um, I remember correctly. Looking like a snack. Looking like a picnic a snack. snack. <laughs> but I can't find the There's size. No oh, wait. <gasps> yes. I got it in a medium, but I probably could have used it in a small because it is a little bit big around the waist, like down here. It kind of bags out a little bit. So I probably could have used it in a small because all of my other bathing suits are in a small and they all fit really well. This one I got, it's just a triangle top. It kind of has this like scrunched material on it and little flowers. And then the bottoms are this high-waisted, kind of high-legged, you know, bottoms. They're also that scrunched pattern. And this fits me really well. It's very tight. It holds me in really well and it's comfy. That's essential. What? Yes. This is the second one I got is this leopard print, which is the trend right now. And then it has these like little black things that go around your body. This is the top, so it's like half purple, half leopard. The back's just all leopard. And the same with the bottoms, it's half and half on the front and then just okay. all leopard on the back. And these are just basic bottoms. They're not like super high-waisted or anything, but this is also super comfortable because it's like a sports bra top. And the bottoms were actually supposed to also have this little black thing on them, but I cut it off because I didn't like how it looked. So I just snipped the black things out of the, out of the inside and cut them off and I like how it looks much better. Last but not least for my bathing suits is this really pretty like light purple color one. These are the bottoms. They're pretty like cheeky. They're probably like my Stand least up. covering ones, <laughs> but they're cute because they're light purple. But the main reason I got this one was for the top. I just liked how the like underwire top look and it just ties in the back and it has adjustable straps. So the adjustable straps and the tie adjustable in the back straps are the move. is what saved me because this probably wouldn't have fit if it wasn't adjustable because I had to make it pretty tight to like hold me in there. So these were a win. So cute. I need to get some. The next thing, we all three got a set. They they saw a lot of things that come together with tops and bottoms. So we all got like PJ slash like comfy lounge, lounge sets. Yeah. And all of them are, and pretty much all that I saw in general, are all high-waisted shorts and like a croppy top. And this, let me tell you, is the softest, at least mine is, the most soft fabric I have ever felt. Like this is like 10 out of 10. Bring some <gasps> comfort. I'm, I'm missing my Go top. Go get it. Go get it. What is that it? No, you you had one job. Two hours later. Maybe we got them mixed up. Oh, oh my, it was here. Okay. That was in my pile. Sorry. So anyway, this is the softest material. I love it. It's all these like almost Easter eggy tie dye colors. The top is kind of cropped. I probably won't wear this really at all because it's also really thin. So like, I don't know, not super bed material if you know what I'm saying. But the bottoms I will wear all the time. Like love, love, love these. They like go pretty high up on my waist and they're like the elastic is really tight. This is not a true like this doesn't cinch the waist, if that helps. I got mine in an extra small and it fits perfectly. So this is the set that I got. 
it's just like it's this like cute like light sky blue that's the top color and again like Calissa's that's the back of it um they're kind of like it's pretty cropped but um it's honestly like really comfy to sleep in and it's the same problem with hers like it's pretty thin so you can't like not wear a bra with it to sleep so I just wear like a sports bra with it so that doesn't really matter but I really like it and it's super soft and it makes me look really tan <laughs> and yeah it was really it's really nice what's you just freaked me with your hair <laughs> and this I think I got in a size small because I didn't want it to be like, if I got an extra small, I'd probably be like extra cropped. Did you take the tag though? So, I, yeah, I did. I got this set. It's kind of also like a tie-dye, black, white pattern. And mine is pretty much the same with theirs. It's really cropped on the top. It actually is long sleeved, unlike theirs. It's pretty cropped. I wouldn't say as cropped as theirs maybe. It's not quite as bad but I probably won't get as much use out of the top just because I don't like things that are like too, too cropped. And pretty much all of us but, wear like t-shirts to bed. We yeah, don't typically we wear like, like baggy pajama orange. tops to bed, which is the only reason. If I was just wearing it like around the house maybe, but like yeah. Yeah. I feel like mostly will work. I've worn mine already. But like, oh, these oh, shorts oh. are really cute and I'll probably wear these like not just to bed. I'll probably wear these out just because mm -hmm. they're cute, they're comfortable, and they're also more high-waisted like up on my waist. So, all in all, it's really cute. I just have pockets. not wear the shirt. Oh, yeah. Which is nice. So that's Mine doesn't. Nice. Pockets in the shorts. Are your, is your drawstring real? Yep. Does it actually say? And a real drawstring. And I got this in a size small. I think they might have had an extra small, but same with Camille. Since it was cropped, I like went with the small because I didn't want it to be extra tight. Which I think small. is good because even the long sleeves like probably wouldn't really fit me in an extra small. I'll start, this is the only thing that I'm not keeping out of all of this. I was super disappointed. Corinna's had like biker shorts for the last like year and every time we actually go biking or other places, I guess, like hiking or outside, we're like, man, we need to invest in a pair of biker shorts. So when I saw them online, I was super excited. Love, love, love the gray camo. Like to look at these, 10 out of 10. Pockets, everything, like love this. But if you can tell, the material isn't really spandexy. It's almost like cotton, so it's not stretchy. And so when they're on my legs, they almost just like bunch up. You'll see it in the in the like little try on part. But they, I just wasn't really excited about it. And the only part that actually has elastic in it is this like, it's a band at the top if you can see. And this band, that's like the only thing that keeps it tight on your body. And then the rest of it's just like floppy. Yeah. So. I will be returning these, unfortunately. I will try again because I still do want biker shorts, but. So I got biker shorts as well, and mine are just like plain black. And I, I actually really like them. I was nervous when Calissa tried hers on because I was like, I don't know if they'll be the same, but they're like, I feel like they're a little bit of like a different material. Yeah. Like they're really stretchy. They're like actual and, spandex. Yeah, and when I put them on, they're like so high waisted that they go like up here, which is good so that they don't bunch up like where you don't want it to. But or fall down. Yeah, or fall down. So I was really happy with these and Oh, I got mine in an extra I got mine in a small and they didn't come in an extra small. If they did come in an extra small, they might have fit me better, but these were small and they were too big. Yeah, I got mine in extra small, so it really, like, hugs me well so that they don't, like, fall down or anything. So, really happy with these. So, kind of on the athletic trend, I didn't get any biker shorts, but I did get this pair of leggings I really for the like gym. Them. And I just thought they were, like, the prettiest, like, magenta color. And they are very comfortable. I haven't actually worn them to the gym yet. I think I'm actually going to test them out tonight for the first time, and I'll let you know if they're amazing. Uh, but from just trying them on and walking around in them, they are super stretchy. They like are high-waisted and they're tight enough that I don't think they're gonna fall down while I'm working out. And since they are so stretchy, I think they're just gonna like move with my body and not like fall down. Cause you know, like sometimes you have those leggings that aren't stretchy enough mm -hmm. and when you do a squat or something, they like fall down. <laughs> I don't foresee this happening with these, so. I'll let you know after tonight, but I think they're amazing so far. 10 out of 10 would recommend. <laughs> it's me um, what size did I get these in? I got them in a size small. So we both got these shorts. They're my new favorite pair of shorts. 
fit me like a glove. I feel like the waist could be a little bit smaller, but if it was smaller, I have a feeling they would like ride up, if you know what I mean. Like if they were too tight, but they are like the perfect length. I like, they have the perfect amount of distressing. They're the perfect wash. If they come in other washes, which I'll have to go on there and check, I will get them in other washes because I love them so much. I We both got them in an extra small. Yeah. So yeah, as was saying, we both got the same ones. And the weird thing is, is that it on, on the shorts, it says it's an extra small, but I tried on both these and Kalissa's and I'm thinking that they like just like tagged it wrong and they're really a size small because they're just like really big around the waist and they don't fit me well. Like at first, I just thought that like this was an extra small and that's just how big they were just going to have to be. So I was just going to keep them. But then when Clusa tried hers on, I was like, hmm. Mine were a little tighter than hers, which yeah. I feel like is true. So I was like, what the heck? Size. And so I reordered and I got... Um, Hopefully it'll come in an actual extra small, but um, to wear these, I I just had to wear like a belt around it to like really cinch the waist in until my. So are you sending those back? Yeah, you get yeah. I ones? ordered. Yeah, I'll send these back. And but yeah, we literally held both pair of shorts up. like up to each other, and Camille's shorts were a good like two inches larger. Yeah, around they like fall off me. The last pair of bottoms that I got are these white paper bag top shorts. I should have tied this little tie because they look weird without them done. Um, also absolutely love, love, love these. I got these in a small and they fit so well. They are very high waisted. They come up like pretty high on the waist and the tie detail is just so cute. But it also, I think I probably could have gotten these in an extra small, but with the tie belt, it really holds them up. And then they're also not tight around my legs either because they're small, so. Love these. They are a little bit see-through, so just make sure you know what you're wearing under them or tucking in, um, but not like crazy. Like you, you can't like see straight through them. You'll just notice color through them, so love these. Okay, moving on to tops. This Ow. is <laughs> the first Sorry. top that I got. It is this pink top and it kind of has like, you can see like kind of little white leopard type print on it. Camille actually got the same one in green that she'll show you next, but um, it just has little ruffles on the sleeves and a little bow tie right here. So it does have like a little hole right here, but the way the bow falls, like you can't see the hole really. So that doesn't make me nervous. And you just tie a little bow there and it's really cute and it's a little short. So wearing it with high waisted shorts, just the length is perfect and I love it. I'll probably want to get it in other colors because they do have some other color options. So this is the green top that Corinne has on. And I pretty much have the same review as hers. Like, um, the, it has a cute little bow at the front. And there is, like, a little hole, but, like, when you cinch it enough, like, you, you can't even tell. So, yeah. And I wear this top with the blue shorts that I showed you previously. And it's just super cute. And I don't have much, like, green, like... Like that's why I didn't get the pink because I just have a lot of pink tops. So this is just something new in my wardrobe. And I think we both got the same size. What size is it? A small? Um, extra small. Extra small. So we both have them in the same size. I think mine's an extra small too. Yeah. But, and I just yeah. love the cute little things on the like ruffles on the shoulders. So yeah. Um, I got this shirt. Uh, it's just like it has like a little peplum bottom that's how ours is too we forgot to mention that i guess a little bit ours is more kind like of up like here at the top yeah, mine's but... like at the waist but yeah and then it just has little embroidering and it actually is embroidered not just like stamped on i guess that's as hard i don't know if it's hard to see from there but this also is a little bit see-through i just buy a lot of a lot of white things and as much as like I love white, it's hard to find good white shirts that you can't just see straight through. So this one is a little bit like maybe out in the sun, but just to look at it, it's almost like a, I don't know, like <laughs> linen. <laughs> it's like a linen material. It's, it's not stretchy like at all. So if you have broader shoulders, like maybe size up. But yeah, kind of like what Camille was saying, um, I will probably wash these tops very rarely the denim shorts and like 
my white shorts, I probably will be fine with washing. But these shirts are made of like 100% rayon or whatever you call that. So I have a feeling as soon as they touch water, they'll like yeah. <laughs> shrink up. So I'll probably wash them as infrequently as I can. I'm just never going to Without wash them, them. Never. being gross, you know? Okay. So <laughs> what size is this? Um, I forgot to check before I put it on. It is a small. Small. I think I got most of my tops size small. So yeah. Okay. Next. So my last top is just this yellow magenta pink type flower top. And I liked it because it had like the high neck ruffly thing up here. And it's more flowy so I think it'd be cute like tucked into pants or shorts. And it is that same like thin material but it fits really well and I got it in a size small. I don't even think they had extra small as an option. So I just got it in the smallest size possible and it's really cozy and it's flowy and comfortable. So I like this one. All right, and this is the last top or <laughs> bra, bra? Top question so, mark? I got this. <laughs> Was that on a model? Yeah, and it looked longer. Do I just have like a long torso? I think you do have a long torso. Okay, That's a good yeah, thing yeah. though. But I think they're supposed but to be like that. Let's I know, be but I didn't think, I didn't think it was gonna be like that short. Like I thought that I could wear it like comfortably with like high waisted like and just have like a I don't know. So and I probably shouldn't have got it an extra small either. So. I feel like it fits well with yeah. the straps and around. Like yeah. I think that I think that you probably should need. Extra it fits well. It's just yeah, it's just it's a really just, itty bitty. It's not for me. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> and like, like a little what, bit of midriff, but like that. What one. are you supposed to wear with this? Like what kind of? If you put this on, your your nips are showing through it. Like how are you? To, <laughs> like how are you supposed to wear this? Oh no, I don't know how. Who wears it now? Um, the next thing that I have, I have two more tops, and I'll quickly go. They're all that same like thin not very not stretchy at all like 100 rayon material rayon ray rayon how do you pronounce that i think i've heard rayon rayon oh well this one's polyester but again polyesters i feel like always shrinks i love this top it's very peasanty i try not to get anything that's too low just because then i can't wear it to work um so this one does have a little bit of a deeper v which is why i didn't end up getting that top because it had a very deep v front but the pattern is really cute. It's almost like a blue, gray. Um, it again has the more drop sleeve shoulders and the peplum bottom. Clearly I have a trend going. Mm -hmm. So love that. It also buttons up the front. It's hard to see with the pattern, but very cute. It only buttons halfway above the peplum. Also love this. I have this in a size small. And my last top is also a size small and this is probably like my most favorite thing that i got yeah that's so cute like, i, I love, love this one. so much Reminds me of a and carnival it's so comfortable reason. yeah it's just very cute it's this striped tank it looks top like a shirt we had when we were like six i know <laughs> and which is why i think i like it it's just very like baby doll yeah yeah like cute and yes. i like just like how it hugs like up here and then yes. it like flares right it has like a really cute figure on it um, I got two things in this haul that have these little bow sleeves. These do come apart 100% so you can like adjust them to your liking and tie them back in. They're not like sewn in to be tied like this. I just have them tied at this length. Um, so whatever length you need them, you can tie them there. And then it's literally just this, even though it has the straps, it's basically just this really scrunchy tube top that you gotta really stretch. Cause look how teeny this looks. Like I got this out of the bag and I was like, oh no. But it fits really well and it is pretty comfortable. The inside is a little scratchy just because it's so scrunchy, but it has this like, I don't know. It's cropped here, but then again, I get everything with a peplum bottom. The little peplum kind of flares at the bottom. It has two layers and just kind of comes out like a little tutu cupcake thing. And I think it's so stinking adorable. I love it. Go get one for yourself. Will do. Thanks. I'll go ahead and show you the rompers that we got. I got this one. As you can see, like it has like a little keyhole type 
thing in the back. And it is a little bit see-through. They do have this in other colors. I think I almost got the light blue, but I ended up actually getting it in black because I didn't want it to be too see-through, which it's still kind of see-through, so I'll probably just be careful about like what I wear underneath of it. But it's really cute, <laughs> and it, it's simple. I thought it just looked so comfy just to like wear around the town. <laughs> you know, just like going out on the town. <laughs> just like comfy, like either at home or just going out somewhere quick. It looks really cute with like a denim jacket. Yeah, like it has the little tie waist and it has like the little um lettuce edging, I think is that what, is what it's called? called. On the bottom, yeah. Around the legs, and then it also has it around the sleeves. So it's pretty simple cute. since it's all black, but it's cute. I like it, and I think I got it in a size small. I think they did have it in extra small, but I didn't want it like riding up my butt or anything. So I did get it in a small instead of the extra small. So <laughs> yeah, this is the romper that I got and it's, I don't know if you can tell on here, but it just has like little like flowers on it that are super cute. And it has a little tie that you'll tie around your waist. And it's just really comfortable and good for like the summer. And I brought this to the beach with us and, um, yeah, it was just really cute, and you can wear with some cute sandals. And I like the um, like I don't really have much like this, like kind of like how you flowy were talking sleeve. about, yeah, like flowy sleeves, and they come like a little bit farther down. But yeah, I just really like this a lot. So cute. You got an extra small. Extra small, yeah. Extra small, yeah. So for dresses, I got this little like pinkish color dress. Let me tie the back. It's so like you a dusty rose. See it. Yeah. I thought it was just a really cute color. I'm kind of struggling because I don't know what bra to wear with it because as you can see in the back, mm -hmm. it has like this bow tie in the back and then it has like a hole right here, but it is like a little bow. And so I have to figure out what bra I'm gonna wear with it. What size is it? Um, I like can't remember what I got in this. This is an extra small. I got this one in an extra small and it's not too short and honestly like, I feel like it's almost a little too big, especially around like mm -hmm. the chest area. It's yeah. kind of baggy on me. So not bad enough that I'm gonna like send it back or anything, but it is cute. The little like frilly sleeves and the tie in the back, I just thought was really cute and summery. The last article of clothing that I got is this little sundress. Again, it has the little tie spaghetti straps. Um, these also are adjustable so that you can make them as long or as short as you need them to be. They're not sewn in. And I think it's just so stinking cute. It's, um, not super short. It comes right above my knee. It has the little, um, white polka dots in them. The top is again, that like elastic scrunchy look. And then right at the waist, it like doesn't flare, but it's more flowy. Sure, yeah. So, love this. I got this in small. What? Oh my <laughs> goodness. God, it is that small. <laughs> the last things that I got, I got this pack of three necklaces. All three of these necklaces came together and they were $3. And I have been in the market for a necklace lately. And so I was like, why not? It came, the set of three was this longer necklace with the horn, this like just regular chain choker, and this like flat gold disc choker. And together they look really cute stacked, but I also wear them like one-on-one -on -one or with two or whatever. My only complaint about these is that like, because I wore these two at the beach and in the sun and in the sunscreen and in the salt water, like I swam with them on, they're like turning that bronzy like not shiny gold color anymore but that's to be expected they were three dollars i kind of bought them to ruin them so i probably will just get another set to keep nice rule of thumb that i use when i shopped on shein because it was my first time now i kind of know what sizes i'm going to be but and i think you might have done this but i didn't buy anything that wasn't on a model like unless i saw it on a person i didn't buy it just because it freaked me out not knowing None of I my bathing suits were on models. I just feel like, I, I don't know. Oh, I've just heard sense. like horror stories about Shein that like you get something and it's like literally nothing I just like, like looked at the reviews and like tried yeah. to see if yeah. other people around my size, what size they got. But then for the most part, like 
I feel like I know that rompers and dresses might be a little too short, so then I got them in a small. Whereas like some things that I could tell were looser, I could get away with in an extra small. Yeah. And I feel like in general, for everything, everything is pretty much ran true to size. I would I would size down in all of my shorts and all the bottoms because that my extra small really worked out well. Smalls basically for tops. And yeah, I feel like generally they run true to size. You can look at the comments and a lot of times people will post photos of them too. So you can kind of see what material it's made out of or what the pattern really looks like in real life because mm -hmm. some of the pictures on there are just like, act like we like each other more than we do. Oh, no. What are you doing in our bedroom? It's me, your father. <laughs> Somebody's conservative. <laughs> okay, I could put this and the spaghetti straps. If you're trying to be a TikTok star, shop at Shein. <laughs> but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video and hopefully you liked our reviews on our items. Make sure you give it a thumbs up and hit the notification bell. And subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget about that one. Yeah. Well, we hope you have a great week and we'll, we'll see, see you real soon. soon. Bye guys.